To calculate percentage change, use Excel. I have the world population here. The population in 2023 is this, and then the population in 2024 is this. To calculate percentage change between those two periods, use this formula here. Percentage change is equals to the ending value minus the beginning value divided by the beginning value. And to express it as a percentage, you need to multiply it by 100. So I'm going to click on this cell. The population in 2023 is going to be our beginning value and the population in 2024 is going to be our ending value. So I'm going to do equals to open bracket. The ending value is going to be the population in 2024 minus the beginning value, which is the population in 2023. I'm going to close my bracket, divide by the beginning value, which is the population in 2023. Click. Now we need to multiply this by 100 to express it as a percentage, but I'm first of all going to do control enter. Now since we already have this decimal number, instead of multiplying it by 100, in Excel we simply need to apply the percentage number format. That will be the same as multiplying it by 100. So with this cell selected, I'm simply going to go to the home tab, number group. This is a command that's used to apply percentage number format. So I'm going to click and you can see. We are getting 1%. I'm going to come here and increase the decimal point like this. And you can see we are having 0.87%. This is a universal formula that's used to calculate percentage change. But when you reduce it to its simplest form using factorization like this one, where EV is the ending value and BV is the beginning value, you get this. Percentage change is equals to the ending value divided by the beginning value minus 1, then times 100. So let's see whether that reduced form is also going to give us the same results. So I'm going to click on this cell and do equals to the ending value is going to be the population at the end of the year 2024 divided by the beginning value, which is the population at the end of 2023 minus one. When I control enter, I can again come to the number group and apply percentage number format using this command here. But the keyboard shortcut to apply percentage number format is control shift and five. And then I'm going to increase the decimal. So the population increased by 0.8%. So down here, I have the China population in 2022 and 2023. Let's click on this cell and we also get the percentage change. So I'm going to do equals to the ending value is going to be the population at the end of 2023. So click, divide by the beginning value. That's the population at the end of 2022. Click, minus one. So when I control enter, and then apply a percentage number format using control shift and five, increase the decimal tab tab. So the population decreased by 0.1%. The positive via means percentage increase and the negative via means percentage decrease. So the percentage increase and the percentage decrease, those are the percentage change.